Ever wondered where history, heroism and paradox collided? Welcome to Oskosh Fortress, where every stone tells a story. Located in the inner Oslo Fjord, Oskars Fortress is a living museum. Built in 1848, it has been a silent witness to many historical events. Get this, during World War II, the German-made cannons at Oskars Fortress were named after the Jewish crop family Moses, Joshua and Aaron were the ones that actually sunk the German warship Bleacher. The irony is hard to miss. Life at Oskars Fortress was like a small self-contained village. From bakeries to blacksmiths' workshops, the community had everything it needed to thrive. They even had their own small theater for entertainment. Did you know, before it was a fortress, it served as a privately owned harbor for merchants and sailors traveling out and into Oslo as a small resting place. But its strategic location caught the army's eyes and it was transformed into a military stronghold. The fortress name even has royal approval. It was named after King Oscar, who after an inspection was so impressed that he lent his name to it. From war to art, the fortress now hosts operas, music events and serve as a museum and even hold a hotel. This fortress isn't just stones and stories, it's a testament to how places evolve, reflecting the ever-changing tides of history and culture. Hi, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, click the like button, leave a comment and subscribe for more content.